give it up for our art department, y'all. Everything looks amazing in here. <laughs> with our friends at Balsam Hill. They created a wonderful tribute to Christmas time in New York City. There's over 100 running feet of pre-lit garland to pre-lit, y'all. Give it up. <laughs> Love it. <laughs> it's the greatest invention. <laughs> Remember when you had to do it by hand? Oh, God. Uh, two five-foot wreaths and all sorts of trees, including a Norway spruce, which is a replica of the giant tree in Rockefeller Center. It's beautiful. Thank you, Balsam Hill. Um, speaking of the holidays, though, the honor of hosting the Rockefeller Center Christmas tree lighting last week. Look, I knew I was gonna have a good time because I love Christmas more than the average bear, but I bawled. I turned around when they lit it and we were like, yay, and turned around and I was like, oh my God. It was so stunningly beautiful. It was just a magical evening. And um, we also wanted to like capture some behind the scenes that nobody's really seen before. So we captured some exclusive content from the, from the show. So here you go. I've rehearsed a couple already. I'm doing it tonight when it's gonna be even colder. All right, everybody, I'm here to host this Christmas special. I'm ready to light that tree. Please welcome Ellie Clarkson. I am so stoked to be here. I'm probably the best person they hired for this because I love Christmas. Yay, Happy birthday. I've performed here a few times but I've never actually been present while the tree was being lit. So this is actually my first time to get to in person and do this. So I'm very stoked, so is my man. The temperature is a word I can't say, cold. Not. I'm having a good time, I'm dancing. It was so exciting to meet the Star Choir today. They did such a beautiful job, I was super proud of them. Congratulations! Thank you. Thank you. 